and welcome back to Lizard Studios. Today we have a wonderful class, guys. We are going to be finishing the collage that we started last week with the geometrical shapes, remember? Today we are going to be finishing it with patterns. We're going to be practicing patterns. You're going to see how that works. I'm going to show you how it works, okay? And you're going to be doing it. And also, we are going to be looking at a painting, this painting by Picasso. It's called bather with the beach ball. So for today, you're gonna need the following materials. Okay, so these are the materials that you're gonna be needing today. You're gonna need glue stick, okay? You're gonna need a pair of scissors for big, for little hands like yours and for big hands like mine, okay? You are going to be needing some markers, okay? We're gonna use um, warm color markers. Warm colors make you feel warm red, yellow, orange are good colors, okay? And you are going, going to need also your piece of artwork that you did last time, okay, your collage. You're also going to need stickers, different color stickers, okay? And different shapes and different sizes that you like, all right? And that your teacher has. And you're also going to be needing newspapers that your teacher previously cut or you could cut it in the class, so you could use it for a frame. All right, so now that we have the materials, let's begin talking about what we're going to do today. Okay, so I'm gonna make this frame around the paper, already glued it, all right? And now I am going to make a pattern around the side of my paper. For that, I am going to use stickers. I am going to use three colors, okay? I have many stickers here, but I am going to pick the ones that I like the most. So I am going to pick orange and pink and black because I really like black, all right? So I'm gonna use these three colors, all right? Now, uh, the first thing that I do to make a pattern is the following. I take a sticker and I put it in the corner, all right? Then I take another color sticker. I'm gonna put them here so you see. I'm gonna take a pink and I put it right next to it, leaving some space between the stickers, all right? Then I take an orange sticker and I place it right here. It doesn't matter which way they go, I just want to make a color pattern. So if I started with black, my first sticker now is going to be also black. And then I am going to use pink and then I am going to use orange again and like that I am making a color pattern all around my paper so watch as I do it okay let's do it Now that I have finished my pattern, my color pattern with the stickers, what I'm gonna do is I am going to cut the frame just a little bit so I don't have all this ugly um, paper coming out. So when I cut the, when I first cut the paper off the newspaper. So I'm gonna cut this off like this and I'm gonna cut all around the pattern. You see the pattern here? I'm gonna cut all around this pattern right and all around here just a little bit leaving some newspaper there to make a really nice frame okay good so now that we have it you know what we're going to do we are going to look at Picasso Pablo Picasso's painting of a bather with a beach ball when you look at this bather with a beach ball, she is wearing a bathing suit and it looks like she's wearing stickers on them. So you know what? I got inspired by this painting to make this collage because Pablo Picasso used shapes, geometrical shapes, to make his uh, paintings and to make his collages 
and just to get inspired and make cubism, which means that you use geometrical shapes to make a person. So now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take stickers and I am going to decorate inside my person. But mine, I think I'm gonna make it, hmm, let's see, maybe like a soccer player, okay? A footballer, all right? So watch me as I do that with my stickers. have finished our collage with the stickers now with the markers here's what we're going to do we are just going to add little details okay so for example I want to finish his mouth smiling so I'm gonna take the red marker and I'm just gonna make a little line like that all right I want to finish also in red maybe I want to make some little circles around here around the newspaper just to make his suit seem uh, nicer, okay, the one that he's wearing. Maybe I wanna finish his suit here, like his shorts and his shirt right here, and maybe make a neck right here. So like that, we see that he is wearing like a uniform for football, like a football uniform, okay? And like that, we see his clothes. Then I'm gonna take the yellow, and I might finish his shoes for example and make little lines just down here in patterns one line two lines three lines just patterns just like that and I might just color in the circles so you have to be creative see how I do this just be creative okay all right and now I am going to take the orange and I am just going to Go over the clothes also, okay? And put a little more color in here. Just to make this a wonderful collage. Now, our collage has everything. Our collage, let's review what it has. Our collage has geometrical shapes, squares, triangles, circles, rectangles, ovals, in newspaper. Then it has stickers. It has a wonderful frame and also it has lots and lots and lots of love and creativity so guys have a wonderful day have a wonderful week and take your collage save it maybe for mother's day for father's day for christmas and just enjoy it all right see you next week with another wonderful lesson bye bye